Save Mr. Campbell. Save Mr. Campbell. Save Mr. Campbell. Donald, hey, what is this, buddy? You're the best teacher I've ever had, Mr. Campbell. And it's an injustice they'd even think of firing you. <laughs> All right, look, nobody's firing me, OK? The, the school's just having spontaneous assessments of all the teachers today, right? I, I'm sure my job is fine. But I, I did this last year for Mr. Murphy, and today I want to do it for you. Right, but Mr. Murphy got fired last year. Save Mr. Campbell! Okay. Well, thank you, Donald. No, Save no, Mr. Thank Campbell! You. There's no need. Save Mr. Campbell! Blake, if you're gonna prank someone, let's use proper English, right? This is an English class, so, uh, hey, uh, what are we missing here? Anyone know? How about a period after the M and the R? Because that is an abbreviation of the word mister, right? God help me if Blake doesn't know that by now. <laughs> okay, good. What else? Uh, we need an apostrophe on sucks because we wanna be sure that we know this is the classroom belonging to Mr. Dick Suck and not the class that Mr. Dick is sucking on. <laughs> and lastly, English is always capitalized unless you're using it as a noun, as in let's put a little English on those balls that Mr. Dick Suck is going to choke on. <laughs> and there you have it. A grammatically perfect Mr. Dick Sucks English class. All right, good. I want you guys over. Look, since this is the last day, I'm going to go easy on you. Uh, how about everybody just pulls out a piece of paper and on it, you write your favorite thing that you read this year and explain why. I'm going to call that a pop quiz. And everybody's going to get an A. Right? Now I'm getting the slow clap from Blake. I love it. Thank you, Blake. All right, we're going full dead poets here. Is that what we're doing? We're getting on desks? All right, you guys know I love to do it. You guys know I love to do it. All right, I'm coming at you. You guys loosen the leg, huh? Good one. You're not doing meth again, right? Yeah, yeah, just a little bit. Don't do meth. No more homemade meth. Got it. No, no, no meth, period. What, am I my period? Don't do it? That's what I needed the most. You're the guidance counselor. You've never done it? Oh, God, no. No. Oh. Yeah. Man. Fucking great. Oh, is it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like the best I've ever Holly, felt. this stuff's got to stop. Right. Right? Yeah, because it's a gateway. It's the finish line. Oh, there's worse stuff. I, I wouldn't know. You ever worn an acid jacket? God forbid. It's a jacket of acid? Yeah, you can only do it when it's raining. Holy shit, Holly. Have you ever used heroin lube? No. It's not great. It's the worst. Don't do it. Uh, you got to get out of this cycle of bad decisions here. You know what I mean? I don't make bad decisions. The wedding ring tattoo? This? Yeah. What's wrong with that? You're not married. Yeah, that one was my bad. Yo, Mr. Campbell's going to get killed. Dude, Strickland has actually gone insane. All I know is it's going down at 3 o'clock. Hey, hey, what is that, baby oil? Hey, stop, stop that! Hey! Hey! Get back here, you little shit! Not the fucking slippery ass! He punched the guy's head clean off his neck. He always carries brass knuckles. He killed a guy with dental floss. Someone tried to poison him, and it just made him stronger. He's trained in Muay Thai. Scary fucking dude. He's in a fight club. He can see in the dark. He kicked a guy so hard in the head, his teeth shot out his asshole. That's it, I'm gonna write your names down. Where's my notepad? Mayor! Hey, uh, can I, can I talk to you for a second? I, I need some help with something. The unthinkable has happened. I think someone took my notepad. Right, yeah, but Mayor, I, I have a situation, okay? I have a situation. 
I lost my notepad. You lost your notepad. Look, I have notepads in my class. Do you have one that says Mihar Kirmani on it? Oh, you had a, a personalized. It's this name? Yeah, I know is what your name it? is. It says M. Kirmani. I got it. You got it? No, I, I got that you meant your name. No, I don't have your personal notepad. You think I'm freaking out because I lost a blank notepad? Yeah, you could start over with I a have... whole new set of notes, I suppose. But what about the old notes? Where did they go? They're gone, I think. It's easy for you to say. Well, you lose your notepad all the time. How do you know that? Because I see the posters you put up all over school. Oh, right. And I get all the emails. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Mihar Kirmani's security and safety S updates. Yeah, is there yeah. any way to get off that email chain? No, I've had that feature disabled. Really? Can't unsubscribe? Nothing? Mm -mm. You know, the trick is you got to keep changing the subject line to get around the spam filters because they catch on. I got to get past this. Look, Mr. Strickland's been fired today, okay? And, and and I noticed that his car is still here. And he was let go hours ago. So uh, can you remove him? Well, technically, he has until the end of school day to vacate school grounds. It's embarrassing. He's challenged me to a fight, so I'm in an unsafe situation here. Oh, that sucks. She's going to win. Can you get him out of here or what? Well, if it's going to occur after school, then it's not really my jurisdiction because I'm the school security guard and not the world security guard. I'm just asking you to do your job here. It's not my job. It is your job. No, it's not. After school, I'm just a civilian like you. It would be like if I asked you to go make hash browns for the students at lunch. No, that's completely different. I'm saying if I was treating you like a cafeteria worker. cafeteria worker? Yeah, I yes. got the analogy. It's just wildly inaccurate. But you're asking me to do the job of security guard after three when I'm not a security no, guard anymore. No, I'm asking anymore. you to do it right now. Sir, I am doing it right now. This is me doing my duty. So you're telling me that there's nothing you can do? I could do CPR. I could potentially revive you after he renders you unconscious. But again, only if it's during school hours. Yeah, okay, look. Yeah, if it's after school hours, you're just gonna lay there all night until 7 a.m. and I'll come and save your life. You're telling me that your hands are tied? I cannot do anything during school hours because I don't have the proper paperwork from Principal Tyler instructing well, me Well, I don't want to bother the principal with this. Okay, well then, good luck. Shit, all right. You cussed, I'm gonna write you up. Oh! Right. The notepad. Oh, God, Susie! Susie! Yes. What's with the coffee? I don't know. What do you mean? I, I just took a sip. It's full of hair. I, I, I got, I got Superintendent Johnson coming well, in. Right I, just, I may, just may have hot. I don't know what happened. Those little fuckers must have switched it. I don't even think what kind of hair it could be. God. Oh, that is pubic hair for sure. God damn it! I just said I don't want to think about it. Could okay. you just fix it, okay? Yes. And give me a. Oh. Oh. Tyler, can I bother you for just one quick second? That was not the time, Campbell. Is he Strickland's car is still in the parking lot? Tyler, I just saw a horse in the hallway. Explain yourself. Superintendent Johnson. Five minutes early. <laughs> And a horse that was, um, that was, uh... You know what I think it is? I think it's just a harmless student's prank is all. Yeah. It's a prank. <laughs> That's pretty good. You got a horse going on. It's not around. funny. It's not funny. No, no, no. It's a major liability. It's a liability, too. Yeah, it really and is. And who are you? Me. Oh, um, uh, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm Andy Campbell. I teach English. Um, don't think about me, just kind of dismiss me. And uh, don't dismiss me, I want my job. But, but ignore me, if you could. Shouldn't you be in class and not wasting our time? Yes! I should, and I will. I just came up here because everything is A-OK -okay at the school, and I thought I'd tell you that. Yeah, everything's good. Gonna go, bye. Yes, hi. There's a crazy guy in my high school. He's trying to beat me up. And, Call uh, police. You, you want me to hold? Uh, are you serious? Yeah. Are you kidding me? Oh, shit. This has to stop. You can't masturbate in school. I'm not masturbating in the school. I'm masturbating on the school. Go back to class. Go back to class. What are you doing? Get out of here. Go. Stop jerking off in the goddamn school. Are you a cop? I'm your English teacher. What the fuck are you talking about? If you're a cop, you have to tell me. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. No, because that's not a real thing, Neil. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard about. Why would a cop have to tell you that? 
It would defeat the purpose of being an undercover cop, right? Anytime there was an undercover cop and, and someone su suspected he was a cop and said, wait, 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 are you a cop? And he's like, uh, yeah, and they fucking blow his brains out. That's the whole point of, of being under... You're a cop, aren't you? I'm not a fucking... I'm not a cop, Neil. You know? I'm your English teacher. <laughs> Just tell me drugs, please. What seems to be the trouble here? Uh, a trickle was smoking marijuana, and he has Molly in his bag. <coughs> now, who are you? I'll straighten this out for everyone. Mr. Andy Campbell, English teacher. Probably a nice guy, but a bit of a worm and a sneak. Mr. Strickland, reputation of a hothead. Scary, yet effective with the students. Do I trust either of them? Absolutely not. All right, we got this. Yeah, we got this. You stay out this shit, me heart. Technically, this is occurring during school hours, so I cannot stay out of this. S word. Yeah, but we don't, we don't need you here. This guy's not the proper authority. I mean, he eats the student's food out of the trash. That was one time. I fished half a banana out of the trash. You eat one garbage banana, and suddenly you're some sort of cereal garbage banana eater. My blood sugar was low. The peel had made it so that nothing else had touched. It's not a big deal, right, guys? Everyone eats from the garbage every now and then. Just a guy. I got it out of the trash. It's the big deal. There is contraband in here. Who does this belong to? Him. Uh, the drug. The drugs were in his bag. Get him. This man is obviously the drug addict. Look at his eyes. They burgundy red. Mr. Campbell's eyes are suspiciously red. Move your hands away from your face. Look up at us. Mm -hmm. Eyes up here. My eyes are, it's very dry in this room, so it's also allergy season. Let the record reflect, his eyes are very red. He's holding an ax! This is true as well, Mr. Strickland is brandishing a weapon. We all saw that. Write it down, boys. Don't want to write it down? Don't write anything down, just arrest the man. You know what? It should be noted that Mr. Campbell did come up to me earlier today in a rather suspicious manner regarding Mrs. Strickland's removal from school grounds. Really? Uh, come on, man. Uh, now you're, you're ratting me out? It is my duty to rat you out. It is not your duty to bring up all the times that someone has eaten a banana where the peel hasn't even touched the garbage. Well, I call, I call it like I see. You know what? I'm trained in this, and I can say with 95% certainty, yes. He was high on drugs. You're not trained in this. Well, I have an intuition about these things. But you're not a cop. Yes, but I have applied many times. And he's never gotten in. Well, you guys know the whole system needs an overhaul, right? I mean, good candidates get left on the floor. I mean, maybe you guys could... Put in a word for me, Mihar Kirmani. I'm guessing I'm the only Mihar Kirmani repeatedly applying to the academy. <laughs> I've got another application going out next week, so if you want to just keep an eye out for this name. If you guys want to look down, if you guys want to look down, look down here. K-E-R. It's spelled how it sounds. A a a am I crazy? A am I the only one that sees what's going on here? Hello? Hello? Not hello, you! Hello! Classroom. Hello, there are drugs in his bag. Hello, this man is obviously the culprit here. Why are you saying hello if you're not saying hello to me? Let's move past it. Just arrest, arrest the guy. Campbell, you've had your say. Mr. Strickland, care to respond? Fuck the police. I get all your emails. Oh, yeah, Mihar Kirmani safety and security updates. That's the one. A lot of great. Yeah. Is there any way to unsubscribe or? No, I had that feature disabled. I've had that feature disabled. <laughs> Stop it. I've had that feature disabled. <laughs> I've had that feature disabled. Did you? Yeah. Go ahead. Why? I've already been guide. Okay, I will. If you stop the budding. In, in. All right? Now listen. <laughs> Look. You can pick this. Whoa. Are 
you saying there's been an altercation? I'm saying... <laughs> Are you saying there's been an altercation? <laughs> no, uh, I'm saying there's gonna be an altercation. <laughs> the only thing I count is pumps. You count pumps? <laughs> One man will enter, and one man will leave. And you know that shit. And I forgot my fucking line. <laughs>